Hi everybody, my name is Emily and I'm a digital artist and today I'm going to show you how I do my animations. A lot of people have been asking, you know, how I do it. It's hard to explain in just a short video, so I really want to go into depth. I've only been doing it for a year, so I'm not a professional. I use this. This is the iPad 11 Pro. It's my baby. I love it. I also use this Apple Pencil and this pencil grip. So the app I use is called Procreate. It's really great. I'm going to show you how I would start an animation just as an example so we're gonna start with a canvas I'm gonna draw a happy face all right now we're gonna go up here into the settings click animation assist you're gonna see your frames down here we only have one right now but I'm gonna duplicate this and I want to make him blink so I'm gonna erase the eyes on the second frame and draw them closed. Now what I'm gonna do is duplicate the first frame and put it on top. Now what this does, if you hit play, you can see he's blinking now. And this is what I use for, you know, all my characters that are talking or blinking, simple things like that. Another thing that's really useful is the background option. So what I'm gonna do is draw my happy face, a little background. All right, so now that we have our background, we're gonna go to the bottom here. Make sure it's at the very beginning, otherwise it won't work. Hit that and click background. Now, what you have is a background that doesn't disturb the animation, it's completely behind it. You can also do this with foreground, so it has to be at the very top this time. So let's make a foreground. Basically, what this, what this is gonna do, this and hit foreground. What this is gonna do is put uh, your drawing over top the animation. So now you have something behind and over top. So when you hit play, you can see it work like that. And this is just the really simple idea, basically how I do it. Now I'm gonna use one of my characters as an example. So we wanna make him blink. So I'm gonna duplicate that and I'm going to draw over his eyes and then draw back with some black. So now he is blinking. Duplicate this layer. We're gonna go over here and turn on animation assist and hit play. Now, once you're happy with your animation, this is how I save it. So we go up here to our settings. We're gonna hit share and we're gonna say animated NP4. Basically what this does is it just turns it into a video. Up here you'll see the speed. I usually turn that down quite a bit. Just so it's, you know, looks normal. <laughs> We're gonna export it. We're just gonna save that. And then I'll usually take it into CapCut and it's a video and I add the dialogue. Now another thing is sometimes it's really complicated to do things that are more complex, like this walking scene. The other thing, maybe for example, is um, him punching. So, I use a special app to get poses when I can't figure it out. It's really great. It's called Magic Poser. Um, so basically, you just, you know, you go into it, and here you can see your little mannequin, and you can move him around how you want. So, it also has presets, which are really helpful here. Um, any pose you kind of want, right? So, for example, if I wanted to make a moving animation, I might do something like this. Screenshot it, and then we're gonna move it again it maybe one more time screenshot it and now we're gonna go back into procreate open a canvas and I'm gonna put in these images one two three so now I'm gonna select all of them and make them bigger just so you can see so if I hit play, you'll see, you know, he's flapping his arms, right? 
So basically what you would just do is select one, turn the opacity down, and you know, trace over um, the movements, and then after delete those mannequin images, and you'll have one of those types of animations. Another thing that I do a lot is reusing drawings for different scenes. So for example, I have this one, and as you can see, I've reused it here, and I have reused it here. So basically, all that you need to do to do something like that is go into your drawing, hold down on the layer you'd like to take to another canvas, pull it out, you're gonna go to your gallery, you're gonna go into the canvas, go into the layers, and it's gonna be in there for you. So now, you can do what you want with it. So we're gonna make him blink again, like that. <laughs> So now you can see he's blinking and I didn't have to redraw the whole thing. So yeah, that's basically how I make my animations. If you'd like to see um, how I draw my characters, let me know because I'll make another video for that. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. I'll try and reply to as many as I can. Thank you so much for watching.